What are you knocking on the door? Yeah. Who is it? You mean King sent me. Can I come in? Alright. It's nice to see a friendly new face around here. It's been a long time. The name's Karen Shenzi. Uh, Evie King told me to check on you. Is everything okay? Scared out of my mind. I'm glad he's checking on us, but until someone nips the problem in the bud, we may as well stay inside forever. Alright, so what's your take on Evie King? He's a spineless wimp. His best solution to the family is to stay inside our homes and hide. What does that tell them? It tells them that we can be pushed around whenever they want. I'm sick of it. And I'm sick of King. Well, he does it in the solar rifle and apparently grenades or a rocket launcher or something as he shot explosives at me. Or maybe it was mine, but again, I didn't hit a mine tick, so probably not. So I think you can keep it safe, especially if there's only one way to enter the town, and that's the ramp. All right, can you tell me what's big, what's about? Can you tell me more about what's going on around here? We're scared shitless. Evan King's got everyone so worked up about the family, no one wants to set foot outside. You're right. That asshole runs the show, but does he really do anything about our problem? No. Yeah. We think of the family. All they do is terrorize us. They taunt us to open our doors, throw bottles at our houses, and scream at us. All right. If I knew King had my back, I'd step outside and show them just how I feel about their visits. Especially after this last attack. Right. How'd it go? Sure. Go. Just like everyone else. So how am I going to solve the problem? After knocking a couple more... Knock, after knock... After... I mean, of course, after knocking a couple more doors. But they have a nice view. They have a nice view from here. Or, you know. If you like the dissonant... Uh... But, you know, if you like the desolate hills and random power uh, extenders around and stuff like that, then, uh, then yeah, that's a nice deal, but, yeah. Alright, next house. Oh, that's Evan King's house. Alright. Oh, we just walk inside, okay. Oh no. Hmm. I like the skill to properly determine the cause of death. Let's go level less than 30 or higher. Alright. Hmm. They kind of look like ghouls, but they're not ghouls. Interesting. Until the west. Nope. Um, do we have anything to. Uh, do we have anything. Do. I mean, we have stuff, don't we? Uh, we have at least the medical uniform. Oh, wrong one. Yeah, we have at least no science uniform, so this might help. Oh, that's why. That's what I activate. And uh, how much? How much? Um, medicine, medicine, medicine. Oh! Oh, jerk game. Yeah, apparently that is good enough, but we just need something to boost it somehow. Uh, we just need one book. And we don't have a book, do we? Oh, we don't need a book. We got mint tats. That is why people, you get mint tats. Is for situations like this. And that's also why you get the science uniform. For situations like this. Alright, mint tats time. And in case the mint tats don't work, we uh, did that. Okay, activate. The bodies of the whiz have been have big marks on the neck area that goes to the bone. Alright, yeah, you can see that as well. Yeah, something drained them. Somebody drained them. With bite marks. Hmm. Interesting. Looks like someone's going to be a vampire kind of succeeding. It looks like, anyway. Oh, what's a note? And also, they're very, very bloody. Hmm. Still wonder what could do this. I guess Chupacabra could do it, but we're way far east to have Chupacabra in our midst. And vampires are also unlikely. Alright, let's talk to Evan West. Evan's how he's pronounce that name. It's not even. I don't know why I like to say... I don't know, I don't why, I don't know why I like to say even instead of Evan. I guess Evan, I usually see that name pronounced well, as okay? even. 
Evan. What did they tell you? Everyone okay? Um, not everyone. Do you know the Whistler dead? The family must have gotten to them in the last attack. Sons of bitches. Damn it! If only we had more men, we could stand up to them. I'm sick of them terrorizing this town. I could probably do it. Wait a minute. When you searched the West place, did you find their son Ian's body? Uh, n I don't think I did. No, I only found the parents' bodies. This has to be the work of the family. I've caught that weirdo leader of theirs talking to Ian down by the river. All right. Look, I know I've asked a lot of you already, but you have to find that kid. He deserves better than all this. All right, don't worry, Evan. I'll figure out what happened here. Thanks, kid. You're all right. No problem. A message for the Western from their daughter? I can't take that. Yeah. You're just going to have to bring it back to Lucy or to Ian if you can find him. All right. Uh, the West had bite marks on their necks. Mean anything to you? Bite marks on their necks? That's the strangest thing I've ever heard. The family must have attack dogs with them or something. Oh, this is all I needed right now. What am I going to do? They'll keep coming back until all of us are dead. All right. Uh, it didn't look like a... Next time I see the family, there's going to be hell to pay. Yeah, un unfortunately, those can't be dogs. I don't think they can be dogs, as, you know, they had the blood sucked out. I don't think dogs can be... I don't think dogs do that. There must be something out here which can suck blood with a bite mark to the neck. Hmm. And the family must have it for some reason, so we'll have to find that out. And also fight Ian, so I guess we'll do that right now. And plus, I don't think uh, we'll do any more fighting other than this, so let's do this. Look at the family, I can do that. Where is it? Alright, there are three possible locations. Uh, that, that. And that. So let's go to the closest one first. Alright, let's go there. Let's keep moving. And I don't need to save again as we already saved uh, when using the mint tats. So yeah, that's why you have mint tats to increase your intelligence. Not necessarily perception, as that's not really necessary. Uh, unless you really want to spot people ahead of you. Uh, and even then, it doesn't quite work out that way. He's a Brahmin. Oh, I got stuff to sell you, man. You already know this guy. Evening. Looking for that special something? I'm looking to sell you that special something. Yeah, we uh, like this guy already. If the clothes make the man, then here are the means to remake yourself. I got I guess stuff for you. I got a lot of star rifles to sell. Oh, you know, is that, you know, is that many caps? Alright, it's fine. Take, uh, take that. Take these. Uh, that's too much. Oh, anything else I can sell? I'm keeping the Metro ticket because I need it. That, oh, that's too much, though. This. Um, take that back. Uh, and then I can just do the deck of shoes, hopefully. Oh, it's over here. What am I doing? Alright, then I can choose. Alright, what next? Um, not much. I mean, you want to keep some food on you to, uh, to eat in the midst of combat in case you need healing, but other than that, not really. Alright, you go. I'll take that much. Or do you have any bullets, for chance? I mean, there should be a top if they, if they did have bullets. Uh, more, more radiation suits, more stun bags, which don't work. Stun bags, glue, stun bags. Stun, yeah, stun, stun, st we have 10 stun bags, that's more than enough for us. Alright, thank you. Another satisfied customer. Indeed. Walk well, friend. Thank you. I have a long way to go. We'll see you too. Alright, I guess we can save right now. Alright, let's get moving. We're going to the closest one first. Um, is that, you see that marker on my compass in the bottom left, uh, the one below the actual compass, I think that's telling me where to go. No, no it's not, it's telling me somewhere else. 
Oh, please, Burger X. Okay, there we go. It's not giving us the three locations, it's just giving us, well, none, so let's place ourselves a marker, our first custom marker of the game, and it's over here. Um, it's becoming nighttime, unfortunately. I guess we should head back. Uh, is there anything down here I want to fight? I don't want to fight that new. Alright, well, we'll have to go in the water. Um, actually, we are kind of running out of time. And, well, uh, we need to complete a quest. And there's a long way to go. This apparently was a little river. But it kind of, uh, it kind of ran dry a little bit. It's over there. It's kind of low. But these, um, these docks would suggest that, uh, the river was this high to begin with. Uh, although, I guess maybe they got filled in with rubble when, uh, uh, I might, they might get filled in with rubble when, uh, in the Great War, but, you know, get filled with all that debris. Uh, but otherwise, it would seem like this river would be, like, more, like, up there, and then, let's picture that big boat. And maybe these, uh, docks were, uh, you know, these docks were, uh, these docks were added later on, as in, right, as in after the Great War. But these boats seem rusted and now of use. Looks like these were from the Great War, or pre-Great War, so, yeah, hmm, interesting. I'm trying to find a place to cross this area. Uh, as you can see, you can't really cross on their bridge because, well, it's close to nothing. You can go, go here, and then the dead Roman. Apparently, he hasn't been able to get the bodies because, well, I don't know, he's, um, you know, he kind of, he's kind of defending the town at all costs, and he's staying in that one position. Camper he is, so yeah, unfortunately he cannot clean up those bodies, but yeah. But that's just one off, okay. Yeah, this is what happens when you take medicine and it goes away, or stim packs, but mostly normal medicines, and sometimes foods, uh, uh, will go away like that. So yeah, and then, and, that, and then what happens, you lose all your benefits. Actually, before we do anything, I just remember wearing the doctor, wearing the doc, we're wearing the lab outfit. So let's get the talent combat armor back. There we go. Alright, yeah, look, no, but you know what? Let's head back to, um, let's head back to the, uh, Friendship Heights. And then we'll rest here, uh, get our health pack, and then go back to, uh, Megaton and then sign off there. As I've been recording for 41 minutes, I could record more, but we might get into more story or something. Uh, maybe this quest book loon out more, so we gotta be careful. Um, by the way, you may notice it was, uh, it was noon when we, uh, fast traveled, and when you fast travel, and I mean, no, it's night, and when you fast travel in a Fallout game, uh, you actually, time passes. So that's pretty cool. Basically, it's showing that your character takes that, that long to, uh, uh, let's see, 12 hours. Uh, it, it basically shows off that, you, it shows that your character takes that long to walk across the world to get to that location. Although, if you were to walk it normally... Uh, as an in-game and not fast travel, it would probably take longer than that. And it probably take longer than that to actually walk it, but it's a nice feature, nevertheless. Alright, let's head back to Megaton. I see Megaton next to, uh, Vault 101, but it's not. Alright, let's head to, uh, what time is it? Oh, yeah, it looks like an hour. Okay, maybe it's, yeah, I guess it's just an hour worth of travel. Alright, let's head to, uh, Mora. Uh, sell our stuff that we can sell and buy more stuff if she has it. She has to cycle her shop sometime, come on. Cause, I mean, she just, she was cycling her shop earlier in the, uh, she was cycling her shop earlier, oh, hi, Nathan. Uh, earlier in the, let's go. What are those hot little potatoes? Yeah, yeah. Been there. It's we have to sell. Sure thing. No, she hasn't. She hasn't uh, recycled yet, unfortunately. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Remember, I'll buy whatever you're selling. Yep. Except if you don't have money. That's not the entirely. 
Oh, I guess let's just head back. Or let's head to the couch and sign off there. But I am really liking uh, Fallout 3. I didn't think I would like it nearly this much. But I do like it a lot. Do I like it more than New Vegas? Kinda. But New Vegas does have more content. Uh, and it has more features. And it has hardcore mode, which I don't personally use. But it's nice, nevertheless. Oh, it's on my couch. And let's put the assault rifle out. Because I like to put the assault rifle on my back as opposed to everything else. I actually prefer the good old um, baton on my side, but when sitting on the couch, it makes more sense to have an assault rifle. Don't ask me how. I mean, I can just show you. That actually doesn't look that bad on the couch. All right, might as well have that on the couch then sometimes. But yeah, I'm really liking Fallout 3 so far. I like it as much as New Vegas. Not quite sure if I like it more or not. It, you know, there are things that I like about it more than New Vegas, but so far, I like, uh, I like, I guess I like New Vegas because it's more shootery, as in your guns do exactly what exactly what you think they should do instead of missing on you uh, which in this game they do if you don't have um they do if you don't have uh, adequate guns or energy weapons or explosives or anything like that or big guns uh, but otherwise I do like it I do like it a lot and, and uh, I am I'm from the East Coast myself of course I'm from uh, Florida so I know the East Coast pretty well especially uh, you know so I just like the feeling of the East Coast as opposed to the West Coast and uh, when I you know in some games, uh, and this is East Coast, uh, Fallout New Vegas is West Coast, so I, eh, I like I like being on the East Coast better. Uh, I know I have the you know it's fr it's a friendly feel because I mean, you you can feel re different regions. It's you know it's it's a subtle thing, but you can feel different regions. Like higher north you go, the more grayer things get, and lower and the more south you go, uh, in the northern hemisphere, the more um, you know the more colorful things get, and the contrast goes higher. So it, it's so it's nice, and I, I know it's nice being on the East Coast sometimes. All right, but and especially since I've never been to Las Vegas, so I don't know what that's like. And New Vegas probably isn't. No, New Vegas is probably not the best representation of Las Vegas, but Good Springs is. It's a good representation. It's a good representation. It's a good representation of uh, a rep representation of Good Springs in real life because that is an actual place, as are most places in the Fallout universe are actual real places. They just um, they, just, they just have different names and they look different. But anyways, I mean, uh, Apollo Three definitely has more of the. Uh, they definitely um. They definitely did a really good job on making uh, Washington D.C. feel like Washington D.C. Uh, so that's a good thing. All right, but anyway, so I'm yeah, thanks for watching. I do appreciate you guys watching uh, this video. Means a lot to me. Uh, it also means a lot to me if you to leave a comment in which I team, in which I can to me in resistance for the series, like where I should go next, and if not, I'll play um, Fallout 3 in general. Even put another series comments for people to know stuff. And um, yeah, so I guess see you in a second.